Hi, my name is Julia Rodriguez and I am majoring in medicine to get my doctorate in oncology. Um, my favorite movie is The Princess and the Frog because throughout the movie she shows independence and creates a very powerful role model and leader to the young little girls or to whoever watches the movie because in the movie she shows that she's working two jobs and that she's hustling to get her restaurant which is her dream so she shows the hard work portion and then when she finally gets the deposit um, for the restaurant, you know, the, the joy and the excitement of being able to accomplish something. So for me, I think that this movie is really cute and it is really sweet. Um, another message that I believe that the movie has is that um, you don't need to depend on, on no one or no man. Um, because throughout the movie, she does it on her own and then Prince Naveen comes and he tells her, I'll help you, but then he kind of entangles her into more little problems that she really doesn't need. So, and then her best friend, you know, she um, she depends on all these men and she's just like, no, I want this and I want that and all these men give it to her because of her beauty. But at the end, um, Tiana gets the prince because of her brains and her hard working and her, her um, quick thinking and her just being able to you know, be independent, it, it caught his attention. So um, not so more that, you know, money and beauty gets you what you want, but hardworking and being driven gets you to the things that are to be gained in life. Um, something that sparks my creativity is being very active. So let's say I'm just um, cleaning my room once I become active and I start, you know, putting things away or organizing things, it, it brings um, creativity for more ideas. So now it becomes like reorganizing my room or um, creating a, a new scheme or um, outlay of it. So um, just being active, you know, gets, gets me going and sparks my creativity. Also, um, not so much just moving around, but being fit. So like running or playing sports, um, going to the gym, those spark creativity to, you know, healthier mindset and, and that creativity brings you to bigger and better um, ideas for yourself. So if um, you're going to the gym and you're eating healthy, you know, it, it creates a better um, sense of yourself. So the creativity comes to you to create yourself into a new person that you want to be or what you strive to be um, within yourself and then the people that you, um, hang around you, within what you have around you or even the way you dress or the way you um, proceed yourself. It creates um, a spark to something new and something that um, pushes um, yourself in a creative way for the better of you. Lastly, um, the third question that was asked is creativity supported by your academic degree or is it just a hobby? Um, for me, in the point of where I am in my life, I believe that um, right now it is just a hobby. Um, yes, it is for me to grow, as I said, like being healthier, being active, or cleaning my room, it sparks creativity to bigger and better things for myself but I don't think it goes towards my um, academic degree. Um, yes, being a doctor, you know, you're always on your feet, you're always moving, you know, you can be on call or like standing for so many hours for surgery or seeing so many patients, it is being active, but it is something to where it is, um, is my job. So yes, my job is also my hobby because I want to be able to help people, but for right now where I'm at, I just, think that being active or more like um uh like being active as in the aspect of um like working out or just being active at home it is towards a hobby um just because right now the mindset maybe because of the pandemic or whatever it is just um to clear my mind of all the work that i have to do or um just creating an, an aspect for myself to where I just can be open-minded about everything and, and not have to worry about the things at that moment that do um, weigh on me. So my creativity is not supported by my academic 
um, degree, but I believe later on in the future, once I do graduate high school and I get into college and more into like my rotations and my um, uh, my residency, I do believe that it would it will spark more of a a creative aspect and environment for myself towards my job and my degree.